I'm going to do an exercise for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you are new to Siamese Mahjong, there are links in the video description below to the rules because the four player game has been modified significantly so two players can play two hands at one time. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. We're going to be dealer for the first random pull. We'll get 28 random tiles. For this first random pool, we have a couple of jokers, three flowers, we have a red dragon, a pair of white dragons, we have lots of cracks, including a pung of ones, a three, pair of fours, five, eight, nine. In dots, we have two dot, pair, three, four, seven, eight singles. Then in bams, all singles, one, three, six, eight, nine. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I would play a year hand and I would play something with three, four. 3-4 consecutive run. Two zero one nine second hand down. We could Pung. We could only Kong either the 9 or the white. This needs a little work. But down here we have 3-4 three, Dragon or 3-4-3-4. Three, four, three, four. A couple of consecutive run options. I might even hold the five. Three, four, can three, four, five consecutive run year hand. That's why I would hold these, but I don't think they're going to be useful because we have a pung in here. This would use the pung and pairs second hand down. We could pung here and Kong one of those. We would need more help there. Here, we're going to need to draw well, of course. But this plan, let's just say we'll include those in our discards. We have seven discards and options. Year hand, consecutive run three, four, five. In this next random poll, we're going to be non-dealer, so I will get 27 tiles. Three jokers, west, pair souths. We have cracks. One, three, four, five, seven, eight, pairs and threes and eights. Down here we have one, two, pung pair, then four, five, six, nine in dots, two, three, eight, nine in bam, singles. If these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I would play one, two, three, four consecutive run, and then five through nine consecutive run. One, two, three, four. I would probably 
fold one through four. I don't think we're going to be able to use this. Five through nine, one through four. Consecutive run. The other day I was playing online and I was focused on evens and odds. If you fill in both evens and odds, you can play consecutive run. So I missed opportunities for consecutive run because I had my tiles broken out in evens and odds. So I just want to do this really quick to see if there are some better odd potential and even potential by separating the tiles. So here, instead of consecutive run five through nine and one through four, we have odds and evens. Two, four, six, four, eight, eight. You know what? Here's the concealed hand. Two, four, six, eight, eight. Concealed. And then up here, we could play little odds. One, three, five. This is not as healthy. One, three, five, little odds. Two, four, six, eight. The two, four, six, eight hand is pung, pear, pung, pung, pung. One, three, five. One, three, five. Maybe we could use these up here for ones, one bams. One, three, five with Kongs of ones. That would be sixth hand down. We have a lot more discards though. Look at all eight, eight discards. Let's see. One, two, three, four. That hand is almost ready to win. With the jokers, that hand is ready to win. One, two, three, four. Pung, Kong, Pung, Kong. With the jokers, this hand is set. Pung, ready to Kong, ready to Pung, ready to Kong. And then up here, we have the eights. I would build around the eights. Seven, eight, seven, eight. I don't think we have two, four, six, eight potential there because we're using our twos here. Here's four, six, here's an eight. That's why I think five, six, seven, eight might work. And then here's nines. I think we could make either one of these work. Evens, odds, consecutive run with little numbers and big numbers. I think there really is equal potential because this hand is almost is actually set. And then up here we have work to do, just like in the even odd plan. One was really close and the other was needing work. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight, second hand down. I would just hold all the tiles. And I would even still hold these. I would get rid of the wins first and see what comes in. 
I think consecutive run is more flexible. If we get three dots, we could even use this down here. We'd have to throw this away though, one through five. This one was a challenge, but if you're focused on evens and odds, make sure that you look for consecutive run potential because the numbers fill in. We'll do one more. Okay, flowers, flowers, joker. Then we have dragons, pair of white, pair of green, north, east, west, pair of east. We have cracks, pair of ones, three, five. Down here we have one, two, three, five, six, nine in dots. And then we've got bams with two pair, two, three, pair of five, pair of six, single nine. So if these were your tiles, what would you focus on and what would be your first discards? If these were my tiles, I would play five, six consecutive run in a year hand. Ooh. Here's a pear hand. Okay. News. News concealed. Five, six, pear hand. If we could get a five dot or a six dot, this hand will be ready to win. I was thinking that maybe we could play the big year hand here. Two, zero, one, nine. But we have a lot more work to do. This is one away from ready. Five or six dot ready to win. I think that's what I would do. And then go with either dots, bams, or cracks for news concealed and use the joker up here. We do have one, three, five potential though. One, three, one, three, three, one, three, five with threes. That would be the fifth hand down. I think what I would do is discard the east. Maybe give up the two nine and go with either a year hand concealed or one, three, five. The thing about the year hand is we're using two dragons here. So maybe one, three, five would be better. These dragons we want down here and that would deplete a year potential. One thing that you might want to consider when you play this game is to not have the same tiles needed in both hands. One, three, five, no need for dragons. I think what I would probably do is discard the East first, take it pick by pick, either little odds or a year hand, but probably little odds because of the dragons down there. When you're playing Siamese Mahjong and you are focused on evens and odds in two different hands, be sure to look for consecutive run potential.
The last time I played online, I missed a ready hand because I was so focused on evens and odds. Those tiles fill each other in consecutively. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next set of random pulls for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules, may all your picks be keepers.